Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Jennifer. In today's video, I had filmed more of a vlog style video uh, for my speed cleaning. And I had an intro video, not sure what happened to it, but it, I don't have it on my SD card. So I'm going to just do an intro like this and then I will proceed into the video uh, just a second here with the rest of the vlog. So we're in the bathroom right now. This is pretty much what I have going on with a makeup drawer um, underneath. Have more makeup, um, just miscellaneous items, and then we have uh, just throw you know, towels thrown in there. Uh, that's my husband's drawer, and yeah, just a big mess. So. Well, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to gather up all my makeup first. That will probably be the easiest because I also have another container of makeup that I can bring out as well as a whole bunch of brushes and everything. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get that all together right now and then I will bring it out to the living room so I can actually lay it all out on the floor and go through it so you guys will um, help me out with that. All right, I'll see you in a minute. And this is actually in right inside of my closet door is some more storage. Each one of these little pockets here have just makeup brushes and just different stuff. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and, ahead and empty this out as well. Um, go through this and see what I can get rid of, if it's expired or if I can, like I said, put it in the guest bathroom. That way if anybody needs anything, it's, a bit, it's available. Okay, so this is the living room and right now I have everything in here. Doesn't seem like a lot, but we'll see in a second. I have a towel I'm gonna go ahead and lay out. Just so I don't get the carpet, um, you know, dirty from any makeup if any, or anything like that. So I'm going to go ahead and get that done. And then after I have everything laid out, we'll go ahead and look and see what we're, what we're working with here. I'm not sure why I feel so sad about getting rid of all this makeup, but I don't need it and I feel like it's just collecting space 
and I'm trying to declutter everything this year. That was a big goal of mine. So I'm gonna go ahead and do it. Don't want to, but I'm going to. And I know this is my time now. I'm gonna be myself, or I could be someone else. No one's stopping me now. I'm gonna skip my breaks. I'm gonna make mistakes. I just wanna feel alive. It's just what I do when I'm out, so. Try not to hold me down Feel alive when I'm in this town Look at those beautiful stars I wanna drive a faster car Nothing can break me No, no, nothing can break me Try not to hold me down Feel alive when I'm in this town Look at those beautiful stars I wanna take a trip to Mars Nothing can break me No, no, nothing can break me drive a faster car I'm gonna be myself I'm gonna be someone else I'm gonna be myself I'm gonna be someone else I'm gonna skip my breaks I'm gonna make mistakes I'm gonna skip my breaks I'm gonna make mistakes I'm gonna be myself I'm gonna be someone else I'm gonna be myself I'm gonna be someone else I'm gonna skip my breaks, I'm gonna make mistakes I'm gonna skip my breaks, I'm gonna make mistakes Try not to hold me down, feel alive when I'm in this town Look at those beautiful stars, I wanna drive a faster car Nothing can break me, no, no, nothing can break me And I know this is my time now I'm gonna be myself Or I could be someone else No one's stopping me now I'm gonna skip my breaks I'm gonna make mistakes I just wanna feel alive It's just what I do when I'm out So try not to hold me down Feel alive when I'm in Look at those beautiful stars, I wanna drive a faster car Nothing can break me, no, no, nothing can break me Try not to hold me down, feel alive when I'm in this town Look at those beautiful stars, I wanna take a trip to Mars Nothing can break me, no, no, nothing can break me drive a faster car I'm gonna be myself I'm gonna be someone else I'm gonna be myself I'm gonna be someone else I'm gonna skip my breaks I'm gonna make mistakes I'm gonna skip my breaks I'm gonna make mistakes I'm gonna be myself I'm gonna be someone else I'm gonna be myself I'm gonna be someone else I'm gonna skip my breaks I'm gonna make mistakes I actually found these from TJ Maxx. It was TJ Maxx or Marshalls. Um, I looked on the back and I couldn't find the little sticker. But they are a three pack and they were about $2.99. And I just love them. They get quite a few uses out of them. Uh, I believe that this one... Uh, yeah, so it says that you can get up to 300 washes out of these. I haven't washed any of mine yet. Uh, I just keep grabbing a new one, so I will definitely let you guys know when I wash it and see how it works. Okay, so I have started going through all the stuff underneath here. I see that I actually have a, um, what's that, hair curler, hair, hair rollers <laughs> back there. I probably haven't used those, uh, I don't even know how long. So those might actually either go downstairs or I could possibly just donate them uh, to Goodwill so somebody else can get some use out of them. 
and yeah so i'm gonna go ahead and start cleaning off the counter i'm gonna wipe down underneath the counter so i have a nice clean surface to put everything back and then i'll go ahead and start reorganizing and see what we come up with Um, what I ended up getting into this little drawer is just like m monthly girl stuff, uh, some face mask, and also um, ovulation and pregnancy tests, that kind of fun stuff. Also, uh, I have some bobby pins here that I just keep in a little mason jar, which is easy for me. Okay, so right now this is all that has to go back into under here and under the the sink so i'm gonna go ahead and see what i can do with organizing it i don't think the hard part is going to be organizing i think it's going to be making it convenient so every day our daily our day-to-day -day stuff that we need just easy to get out and then um it'll be easy to put back and hopefully I can make something work. I didn't think I was gonna have time to go through my husband's drawer, but I think um, it's screaming for attention. So I'm gonna go ahead and take just a few minutes, go through his drawer, and then I'm gonna finish cleaning up and I will show you guys the final product. So I am all about um, not using paper towels and trying to use um, microfiber towels and stuff. But when I clean the mirrors, I cannot get like lint and hair from like the dog, um, just anything off the mirrors. I don't get, the only way I get a really clean look to any of the mirrors is if I use um, paper towels. So if anyone has a magic towel that they want to share go ahead feel free let me know so that I can go ahead and uh, try that out so let's proceed okay so I took my pigtails out and this is pretty much the kind of curl that I get which is nice but I actually prefer my hair straight and then curled I don't know. It was just easy to, last night when I got out of the shower to throw it in pigtails for the gym this morning. I'm probably going to take a shower after this because I'm a hot mess. And then I'm going to edit my closet office organization video so you guys can see that tomorrow. And then if I have time tonight, I'm going to film another video on the three businesses that I have. I do have three jobs. And now I want to be a YouTuber, so just adding another thing to the list. But I always wanted to do this, so, and my dad did pass away last year. And I know I've been a little pushy with wanting subscribers, but he did always teach me that closed mouths don't get fed. So if I don't put myself out there and ask, then nobody might know that I'm actually looking for subscribers. And... And all, that's an ultimate goal of mine, is I would love to have... A lot of subscribers so I do appreciate everybody that is here and watching the videos it does mean a lot to me so I'm gonna go ahead and show you what I came up with for under the sink and then there will be another video that I'll be doing in here like a deep clean master bathroom 
and I will let you guys know how I've been doing with keeping up with the organization, making sure things get put away, things stay clean. So I'll let you guys know how that turns out too. Okay, um, I did add this um, little plant here, which I actually had somewhere else in the house. As much as I love buying decor pieces, I do love uh, repurposing things in the house and putting them in different places. So I took away, I had a little wood thing right, right here that had um, the deodorant and stuff in there and also Q-tips, but just moved them over here, put them in a little mason jar with uh, next to the toothbrushes and the hand soap. So I do love this nice uh, clean look on the counter. Not a big person that likes a lot of knickknacks and stuff. That's just my personality and how I like things. Uh, so let's go ahead. I did um, tell you I cleaned out my my husband's drawer. He does play in a, in a band, so you'll always see pics laying around the house too. I always keep him in there for right now. And then my drawer, I end up moving like the toothpaste, just some of my night cream, um, my face wipes, and yeah, I actually had a hard time finding things to put in here, which has never happened before. <laughs> okay, and then over here, I just moved, um, a lot of times I don't, I won't wash my hair every single time I shower, so I'll put a hair cap on. Uh, just to protect my hair from getting wet because I do have naturally curly hair very dry and it takes me a long time to do so I um, want to preserve uh, the hair straightening as long as I can um, I know I did stick to my um, my goal of whatever I could fit into like this container that hair container and then this one as well I did stick to my plan and I think it turned out just lovely. Um, up there I just put a blow dryer and uh, hair straightener and hair curler. I did end up keeping those curlers back there <laughs> just in case, you never know. I'll just hold on to them. They're not, there's not a lot of space that I can do back there so I'll just go ahead and keep that there for right now. And then there's makeup that I didn't want to get part with, didn't want to get rid of, just kept it in these things. And then this bag right here, I'm not sure if Tara Henderson uh, actually discovered this bag on Amazon, but she did post it. I can't remember who she said she um, heard that from. It might have been Liza, I can't really remember. But I've got this bag. So far I love it. I actually got the matching wallet too. Um, and then this also just has my everyday makeup, stuff I use every single day. Um, back here I just put some medicine, some other, some other items. Um, I'm not sure, I found this, I don't even know why I have this. This is some kind of facial, um, something, I don't know, I'm not really sure, but it looks expensive, so I'm gonna do a little bit of research and see if I can find out why I have it. Uh. Up here I just put a basket with uh, shaving cream, some extra body wash, uh, mouthwash. And then like I already showed you what was in here, but yeah, just put that down here. So just easy to get to. And then the last cabinet is just our, again, just medicine, band-aids, uh, miscellaneous items. I did have this change thing up on the counter, moved it down here just for right now to see how I like the counter space with not a lot of stuff on there. And then just our deodorant and some perfumes and colognes. So that is what I have so far. I hope that you enjoyed this video. I'm gonna give it a shot and see how it goes. Hopefully everything works out and I can stay organized. Did get rid of a lot of stuff. Um, and I will hopefully be able to pass that on to some of the girls in the family. And yeah, so I'm going to go ahead, like I said, take a shower, get busy tonight editing for the closet organization video for tomorrow. And then hopefully I can film tonight if I have time the explanation of my three businesses that I have, why I have them, how I have them. We'll see how that goes. I haven't done a sit down video yet, so it'll be my first one. And 
yeah so i appreciate you guys' patience and i've been having a lot of fun making videos thanks for coming along on this journey with me this youtube journey if it's been fun so far it's only been a few days so i really appreciate it and yep yeah, pass it along that there's a new cowgirl in town you want to say good night say goodbye say goodbye to everyone say bye say bye Kisses. Mm.